I'm going to be real with you guys. I'm not going to BS. Um, college football is just not my thing. I stopped making college football videos years ago, but a subscriber, he sent me a comment. He said, you know what? I want you to bring college football videos back. Make some college football videos. And I told him, you know what? I'm going to drop an OSU Michigan video on Saturday, so be on the lookout. And I watched the game. It was a great game. And um, I was contemplating on even uploading this video still after I watched the game because this is just not my thing. I'm into pro sports, the NFL, the NBA, um, the WWE, things like that. Um, college sports is just not my thing. So I wasn't even going to upload this video, but I got to. I can't let I can't let dude down. So here it is. OSU goes into Ann Arbor, Michigan. And they get the W over the Michigan Wolverines, 30 to 20. Michigan, the Wolverines, they fall to 8 and 4 on the season. OSU improves to 10 and 2. I'm not going to lie. Wolverines, they were on top of things in the beginning of this game. I mean, the facts are there. They were up 14 to 0. John O'Corner in his offense, they got going. The running game looked good. The passing game was doing decent as well. And the Wolverines were up 14-0 just like that. And JT Barrett and that OSU team, they were struggling on offense and on defense because John O'Corn had that team going for the Wolverines. But your boy JT, he said, I'm not going to let this fly. I can't let this happen. I'm going to get my team back into this game. I'm going to make some big plays with my feet and in the passing game. And this defense has to step up, and it better step up. And you know what? The defense delivered, and the offense delivered. JT Barrett, he rushes for a touchdown, and he passes for a touchdown. He threw a touchdown pass to his tight end, and just like that, it was a tie game, 14-14. to But OSU was not done yet. They were not done yet. In that second half, they outscored. Michigan, 17-6. to six. That's how they got the W. Michigan's offense was struggling. They put up six more points in the game. They took a 20-14 to 14 lead at one point. But OSU, they came back charging. And late in the third quarter, JT Barrett gets hurt. They bring in backup quarterback for OSU. He comes in and does a decent job and makes some big plays. OSU, they just dominated this game in the second half. Like I said, outscoring Michigan 17-6 to in that second half. It was nothing Michigan can do offensively, and they couldn't stop OSU defensively. And then late in the game, you got John O'Corn throwing a late-game interception. Yeah, that's not good. I mean, OSU, they brought it today. They brought it. And Michigan... They have lost six straight games, including today, against OSU. They have not beaten OSU since 2011 when they defeated OSU 40-34. to That's the last time they beat Ohio State. It's been six years. Got to fix that. So John Harbaugh is now, I believe, 0-3 against OSU. I believe he's 0-3 against them. And, yeah. Not a good look. Got to fix that record. You got to turn that around. But overall, it was a good game. I enjoyed it. It was nice to enjoy a college football game and not even be bored watching it because, like I said, college football is just not my thing. College sports are my thing, period, whether that's basketball and football or whatever. But um, I enjoyed this game, and I'm glad I can bring this video to you, bro. Hope you enjoyed it. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much it for me. Um, you guys know what to do. Like this video, share it, leave a comment in the comment box below. Tell me what you think on this game. And, um, who's going to be in the championship? Who's going to make it to the national championship? Um, let me know in the comment box below. Who do you guys predict will be in the national championship game? And, um, I will have a video for you guys for that. When it comes January, best believe. Um, I do be watching that, but throughout the season, I don't really watch the games. So, hope you guys can understand that. 
Turn on your post notifications to subscribe. I'm out.